looks cool, don't it? With a Vader with a stormtrooper. Hey, John, what do you think? Yeah. Have you still got an organizer? Yeah, I'm always working on it. I mean, it's 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 a big work in progress, right? Yeah. There's John Robert. Say hello, John Robert. Yeah, shake of the hand. Hey, John. Man, so this is this is pretty cool. Should I bring the other one in here, or just these two? That's just it. those two, because the other one's not really. They don't go with these guys. These yeah. Classic. You know what would be just cool? Classic Star Wars. I don't want to cover this up, because this is technodrome baby. <laughs> This is Vintage Turtles, is and that, I'd have a bunch of people Is that open or is that mint? It is mint. It's never been played with. Never been played with, but it's been opened. But it, the box opened up. I don't know if someone pulled it out to look at it. The tape was cut. I think they pulled it out. I pulled it out to make sure it was all, it's all the inserts and everything are still there. Oh, okay. So the glue just came undone probably. Yeah. And and I, it being that it's 30, 30 years old. Right. I have a sewer place set up there, but it, it needs some help. But the box is cool. Yeah. So, anyway, a Technodrome. I give Tony some of the dumpster dive stuff that I find, and look, there's the Star Wars Battlefront stuff. Yeah, I want to frame some of that for the front room, because that's where the front room's going to have, we're going to take down some of the stuff that don't look very cool in there. Yeah. So there's the infamous uh, metal tr uh, lunch boxes that are worth, uh, what was it, Tony? 5000 each? Uh, <laughs> uh, according to that one, uh, <laughs> that one video. That one video. Yeah, I'm gonna be selling my $5,000 piece lunchboxes. You could retire right now. Yeah. $5,000. Give a check. This is by far the hottest Frankenstein ever. Do you see her there? Who would want to put a bag over that I head? I know that's not cool. We gotta get rid of that. That's not uh, cool. it's all right. That's hey, a... okay, we can cover up, cover, the nips cover up the nips with the lanyards. Uh -huh. That's, yeah. that's right there. I think it's a Freudian slip on Tony's part. Yeah. Where the hell did you get that at? Uh, we found the um, mannequin. At, I think it was at Warrington, and then the monster mask was in one of the boxes we were bringing from the storage unit. Oh. Um, well, I I, I can the bring mannequin. I can bring my killer clown outfit, and we can dress. I wanted the... a mannequin so I could put an outfit on it, but I didn't think I was going to get a seductive woman. I mean, that somehow doesn't work with what I was going to put like a really crazy looking, and there's this baby. <laughs> oh, you ought to rotate the masks. Right? Yeah. Rotate it that way. But it's, it's such a provocative, time. I don't know. I was going to put an outfit on it, but you know. Yeah, that's a really good lunchbox. I mean, actually, I know it's not metal, but that's the only I think, one they, they didn't make I think only one. three of the people on that cover are alive. Oh, really? Roddy uh, Piper, Hulk Hogan, and the one on the right. No, he's dead. Hillbilly's he Hillbilly, that, yeah, he no, no, that dude's dead. That's actually that's Bruiser Brody. Oh, yeah, he died in Mexico. Uh, well, that what probably, happened to him in Mexico? They stabbed him in the shower. Why? Uh, promoter or something issues. He, really? That was uh, the year when wrestling stopped going to Mexico mm -hmm. uh, because they of that incident. Bruiser Brody. Really? Yeah, they killed yeah. him in the shower. And who are these two? Do um, do I don't remember right offhand. There's actually a picture. Right, Piper's still alive. Isn't yeah, it's yeah, only Hogan alive. and and Piper that are, I think are the ones that are alive. And one of the guys, I think the guy in the red, on the right. We know Andre's gone. Yeah, Andre's gone. Bruiser Brody's got stabbed. Yeah, he was, he got you have a shrunken head in the box game right there. Yes, we do. This is from the. Um, I'm gonna say I don't know if it's late '60s, early '70s. It is. Is mint. it complete? It's mint. Mint? I mean, it, the box is not mint, but it's never been used. Never I found been used. It, I found it at a. I found it at on my trip to Warrington. It's an apple yeah, sculpture. You, oh, oh, you use an apple. You use an apple. Wow, look at that. Mm -hmm. Man, they pay major money for that here now. Mm, right. That's actually really nice. It's all nice. Where'd the, you find it? At? I found it, it, it on one of my. It's, trips to Warrington we were I found it on a bottom shelf and um, I got it for a real good deal cool and uh, I wasn't going to take it but I've always wanted one and I always you always find them and they're used and they look like crap when they're used because it's an apple thing so you know everything looks dirty so this the fonts, fonts you sleep night. with the fonts yes we sleep, yes hey. I'm surprised you don't have a Gilligan one with your Miss, Gilligan hat Mr. C hey. Oh, no. This is Fonz. He's still cool. Where'd least, you get that at, Garage? Same Warrington. Oh, Warrington. Warrington. Actually, that's actually 
1970. Man, I don't know. See, that would look really cool oh. up there too. It's in good shape for something that age. Yeah. It is. It, uh, my wife threatened me. She told me not to bring that home. <laughs> that I wasn't going to buy it. And the lady that I was at Warrington, she gave it to me. She said, "Please take." Fonzarelli home with you, and I was home. like, but I don't think I should. What is this bad boy? She, she didn't want you to get it, she couldn't trust herself around it. This isn't He-Man, is it? That is one of the, what a lot of people search, they look for. It's um, it's from the 80s, it was made to uh, go with He-Man, and um, Remco figures and all that. Actually, Imperial made those, and they made those specifically for people that collected He-Man toys because there wasn't enough rides out there. There was Battle Cat. There was, you know, what, what are you, and, and Panthor. So wow. you're supposed to put your creatures on. And they sold, they made probably a bunch of money off that.